guys. Today we are going out. We're going to the Capilano Suspension Bridge. Please come along with us and let's go. We used to have each other's playlists. No, no. It used to be. So once you arrive, the first thing you see is the story center. So it's just a historical collection. It's, you know, different pictures and write-ups of stories about how the suspension bridge was built, when it initially started, what the need for it was. Uh, I believe there was no way of crossing between two different areas. And people needed to cross over to um, go to work so that was why they built the suspension bridge in the first place it's it's quite long <laughs> don't worry you're going to see it soon so we went around we saw juju calabar <laughs> well not juju calabar but these statues that they have like they just had like some statues all over the place was so beautiful the trees were really tall like uh, if somebody should fall down there eh, it'll be small but everything was just nice the place there were different write-ups you know about how the bridge was built its strength its foundation comparing it to known places which was really nice then we also went uh, through the cliff walk so before we even got to the suspension like walked on the suspension bridge we went on the cliff walk so this is the cliff walk it's just uh, you know a lot of steps and a pathway I will call it like built on the cliff around the cliff of the rocks it's really really high up so if you're someone that's scared of heights i don't think it's something <laughs> i would recommend but it was nice it was it was fun it was really really beautiful you know just seeing the view the waters the trees it's just like you know when you're in nature it, there's just this beautiful and amazing feeling it gives Say so hi. that's that hi. was like the feeling and the experience that we got with being hi. in this place um this thing is scary Now we finally got to the suspension bridge itself. 
guys this bridge eh, i won't even lie to you it was scary like the bridge is not hanging on anything see the way i was holding i was even holding the two rails i was shaking even vic was teasing me yes, yes. Well, thank god that part was over then we came to see some birds guys these birds they are not kept there they just fly in every day and then they are displayed and in the evenings they fly out 20 percent of the reason for their demise in the wild is due to natural predation and the other 80 percent are human causes hit by cars electrocuted on power yeah. lines um wind turbines are taking out a lot of birds solar panel ray fields actually uh, killing a lot of animals not just birds we used to have each other's playlists no no used to be each other's best friend so we decided to head on downtown to the dimension gallery it was really exciting to be here because it's like you're seeing something but something else is happening in your head <laughs> with your handbag <laughs> i identify as you again but i don't want to think what's happening but who cares Michael, Michael, calm down. No. <laughs> Michael, calm down. In a day, I left my heart out to you so you could see me through. After leaving the Dimension Gallery, we just decided to walk around downtown and then go on the sea bus. This was Victor's first time being on the sea bus, and it was my second time going on it so we were both excited i mean the first time i went on i was excited and i was happy to share this experience with him <laughs> why are you climbing <laughs> why are you climbing down this thing <laughs> with so much energy <laughs> You're not playing football on the sea bus. <laughs> <laughs> So we are trying to look for a restaurant to eat because ha the hunger eh almost is is deep man. Walk out with that direction. See pizza? Do you want pizza? I don't want pizza. This your video is cutting my head. Sorry. I know height is not is not. You're not disbelieving me. It's okay. Guys, we've got five food. Back. Bye.
Don't chop the food. <laughs>